You're watching us tonight from Franklin Town. You're asking for the city to step in and shut down a property management company. Now, this company is all too familiar for WMAR 2 News' is Dave Detling. Dave has been sharing your horror stories of doing business with this company. He is at a new property tonight where the problems are spilling over. Dave? Well, the tenant you're about to meet also having problems with WAZ management here at this property in Franklin Town. One of the issues is flooding. It is so bad at one point sandbags had to be used. This is the new key that he gave me, so let me try this one. Locked out of her apartment by WAZ management. It's the latest headache for Elena Shake at her place off North Forest Park Avenue. Outside, there's trash pileups, city recorded rat infestations, and fecal matter flooding her apartment. There's feces all over the ground. You will like get the neighbor's bath water and toilet water coming down from like urine, feces, just whatever on top of. You got bugs in there. Baltimore's housing department has been out to inspect the property and citations have been given out to the infamous property owners, but WAZ management doesn't seem to care. What would your warning be to people out there who see WAZ management and properties for rent? I would say don't run from them. Elena's apartment problems started back in October. She says she's gone to escrow court and has since moved in with mom in a nearby unit. There shouldn't be a flood so bad in someone's apartment that the floors and the woods, the, the flooring starts to break apart. This should not happen. This is ridiculous. The mother daughter duo say the company's principal owners, Benjamin and Isaac Ozana, are adding to Baltimore City's housing problems. The city needs to stop, step in and stop him from getting building permits, from leasing these properties. Like they need to be, they need more than just to pay some fines. WAZ management is already on the city's radar for dozens of housing violations. There's also an investigation following a massive fire at one of its buildings on Maryland Avenue. Tenants in Franklin Town say the slumlords are scammers who need to be put on blast. Let's start shaming these people for having the audacity to make others live like this. And a check of online records show that a number of these citations here at this property have gone unfixed by WAZ management. Reporting from the Franklin Town neighborhood, Dave Detling, WMAR 2 News.